we'll study about aids now it was discovered in 1981 since then this pandemic disease has killed more than 25 million people world over aids stands for acquired immuno deficiency syndrome in this disease the immunity of the body becomes very weak this is due to a viral infection the name of the virus is hiv human immuno deficiency virus please learn the structure of this virus it is a retrovirus having rna as genetic material this disease spreads with sexual contact with infected person transfusion of infected blood sharing of infected needles and from infected mother to the fetus so the most susceptible people who are prone to this disease are the people who have multiple sexual partners or people suffering from diseases like thalassemia where regular blood transfusion is required so this disease spreads only through body fluid it does not spread just by contact with a aids patient or even by sharing any items with the aids patient that's why the stigma should not be there in the society against aids people let us now understand more about this disease the incubation period of aids ranges from few weeks to many years let us now study the physiology of this this is very important aspect the virus enters the macrophages where the rna of virus gets converted to dna by the process called as reverse transcription now this viral dna enters the nucleus and gets incorporated with the host cell and directs the host cell that is macrophages to produce more of viral rna that's why these macrophages act as the viral factory hiv factory these viruses now enter the t helper lymphocytes and destroy them they keep on attacking more and more t lymphocytes as a result the immunity of the body keeps on going down as a result the person starts suffering from various infections the infections which are otherwise people are immune to it aids patient they become susceptible to these infections most common of these infections are infections like tuberculosis caused by mycobacterium other viral infections fungal infections even the worms like toxoplasma can enter the body and cause diseases that's why the immunity of the body goes down the test which is generally used to identify aids is called elisa which stands for enzyme linked immunosorbent assay though there are few drugs or medicines available there is no cure for aids these drugs can just prolong the life span that's why aids is a non curable disease people have to be made aware 
about the various parameters of this disease basically the knowledge about the safe blood about non sharing of the needles also the drug addiction has to be eradicated sex education has to be introduced into the schools and the society has to be taught about the ways this disease spreads and how to prevent these diseases this disease so who world health organization has taken up lot many efforts in this direction even in india an organization named naco national aids control organization is basically responsible for spreading the awareness about this disease by pay, making people know that there is no cure for this disease only prevention is the way by which we can stop this aids so first december is considered as world aids day so on this day these agencies who naco and other organizations they make people aware they teach the people about the severity of this disease so that people can protect themselves from this dreadful disease so please go through this topic this is very important from exam point of view